Right, hello again. So today I'm going to be showing you how to get the remote mouse app updated version. I've had a few people saying that it's not working, they're getting errors and it's not downloading the APK properly on a lot of videos. So I just want to put one up there so you ain't going to mess about looking through YouTube, looking through Google, spending hours trying to find a way to get it. Mainly for your show box, but there's some, um, some other apps that do require it. So this is plain and simple, easy to go. You'll have it installed in a good few minutes like so. Yeah, don't forget to hit subscribe, a lot of videos are coming, bit of time off work as well, so move in. So yeah, don't miss that. Let's crack on anyway. Right, so if you don't mind, hit subscribe. It's free, and once you hit subscribe, you're going to see a bell icon next to it. Click on that, get a notification every time I upload a video to YouTube. And just above that, you'll see my Facebook and my Twitter link, where I also put up the new uploads to let people know that a new tutorial's gone on. Next to that, you'll see my PayPal link, that's just a way of people to donate, but... I'm not asking for your money, don't worry. So yeah, let's crack on. Right, so like I say, we've had a couple of problems with um, some of the links for remote mouse app. So I'm just going to show you a secure way to get it. It's sound. It's worked every time. It's never let anybody down. This one, you want to go on device first. You want to go on your developer options and make sure your apps from unknown sources turned on. So once you've done that, you want to go back to the home menu. And then you want to go to the search symbol in the top left-hand corner. Because we need this app here, the downloader app. A lot of you will already have this, but for newcomers you won't have. And all you want to do in the search icon, you want to type in downloader. And then once we've typed that in, we're just going to click on downloader there, and you'll see it'll come up. When you click on that, if it doesn't download, it's because you've got no bank details set up to your Amazon account. I know it's a free app, but they do require that you have some bank details set up to be able to download any app from their store. And then what you want to do, you want to launch the downloader app. And then once we've launched that, you'll see this. So we want to enter the URL where we're going to get the, first, the app from. So you want to type in troypoint.com forward slash app. And bear in mind, this that you're downloading now is not just for the remote mouse. You can get literally nearly every APK you can think of here. Pretty much everything apart from IPTV APKs that, that work great. So once you've put that in, you're going to click install. And then once we've done that, we're going to click on done. And then you're going to click on delete. This will just delete the file, the APK itself. So we're going to delete that and get rid of that. Obviously, your app will still stay in there. And you want to go back to your apps. And you'll see you've got Aptoid TV. This is a free app store for Android. It's awesome. Everything's free. So we're going to launch that. And then as you can see, there's already like editor's choice, top applications, like recommended apps. We're going to click up and go on to search. And then I'm going to type in mouse toggle for Fire TV. And like I said, this APK we're using to get it from, it's never let me down, it's awesome. If you do have any problems with it, it says error, just bear with it, close it, force stop it, launch it again, it'll work fine, don't worry about it. So we're going to click next on that. And as you can see, it doesn't come up with it straight away. You can see it's a um, remote for fire. It did used to come up with a um, mouse toggle for fire TV on there as well. Just click on there, see if it's in here. So you've got another one there. I'm not sure what that one. I've never used that one. But the mouse toggle for Fire TV, it looks like that one's gone. But you have got the remote for Fire. That, Yeah, I'm going to click on that. Remote Fire TV. You're going to click on Install. And then you're going to click Install again. And done. In fact, we'll open this one because if it doesn't work, you found on the first time, 
sometimes it'll not work when you double um, double click your player button plus it'll only do it inside an app you're going to um, enable the remote service click that off and you'll it'll stop it and then you're going to click it again and it'll start it back up so it'll like refresh the app and then also you can um, switch the auto start and boot off and then back on and that'll just refresh you as well and then once we've done that we'll go back we'll launch an application we'll launch free flicks good little APK this as well if you haven't already got this it's on my channel along with a lot of different um, APKs but yeah there you go double click your play button you can see it's the sound mainly for showbox and apps where you do actually need the remote mouse but Everyone needs a remote mouse for a lot of things on here. A lot of IPTV APKs as well require them. So yeah, I just wanted to put this updated version on so people aren't struggling to get it. I want them to be able to click on my channel be able to get things that they're looking for. And yeah, best way to get it is that, trust me. So I'll see you shortly because there's a lot of videos coming up as well. Got two weeks off work, can I? So yeah, enjoy and I'll see you again soon. Ta-ra.